Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another review slash unveiling of one of the bags that I am using currently and I've been very happy to have it for some time. And we're talking about the Louis Vuitton Porte Documents Jour. So here is the bag. This particular bag is made out of the Damier Graphite. Features uh, leather handles, cowhide leather handles with uh, the attached uh, leather trim. The hardware on this bag is in silver color and it features the D-rings for attaching a strap, which is a very functional thing to have on a bag like this. You could call this a work bag. You know, I think it's a work bag, like kind of going to office bag, which will hold the computer. And I'm going to come to that and I'm put my computer in so you guys see how it looks. From the outside, uh, the bag is pretty much, you know, just does, does not have any outside pockets, which on one side it helps it to, to be very, very elegant looking. But on the other side, you know, it's not the most practical solution. And, you know, we can talk about this. I'll talk about this. I'll mention this a couple, a couple of minutes later in this video. So, um, very nice zippers as always on the, on the Louis Vuitton bags. The zipper itself is very, very smooth. I mean, and this is, you know, it's just effortless. And this is with all Louis Vuitton products. I mean, they just, the way that they made the zippers, it's just very, very nice. And, you know, uh, it should be that way for, uh, for the amount of the money that the stuff like this costs. So, um, inside the bag, and I have mine stuffed with the paper to preserve the shape, as you can see, because the bag is really nicely shaped. Um, and in order to keep it that way, I stuff it with paper. Just to just to keep the you know try to keep the shape intact. Um, taking the paper out inside of this bag uh, is at the moment my strap that came with the bag. Um, the the strap is uh, your standard canvas strap for this bag, um, which is I think it's it's quite comfortable, especially when you wear it in a bit. At the moment. When it's you, it's very stiff, but once you start wearing it, it will soften up. In, at the end of the strap, uh, the hooks are obviously silver, as you know, the rest of the back hardware. And they are attached with the same leather cowhide trim as it's uh, on, the, on the handles of the back. So this is how this looks. I hope it's going to zoom in. So, very nice. There we go, that's the strap. Um, this is, uh, you know, the smallest of the bags from this collection. So you have uh, the Jour, which is makes, basically means day. Then you have Voyage, then you have the Voyage GM. And you have the Eye Care, which is the biggest of them all. Um, they are, in my opinion, made for different, you know, for different occasions. This one is your little, I mean, it's not so little. Uh, but the smallest one, and by that maybe the most convenient to, you know, tote it around every day to the office or something like that. Then as you go up the bags become bigger, but also they feature more pockets, more versatility, you know, the attachment for your uh, trolley or uh, your luggage case and so on. But this one doesn't have. As I said, one of the negatives, and I'll get this right out of the way immediately now, is that this bag, I mean negatives for me, is that this bag does not have any outside pockets. Meaning that when you want something from this bag, you need to open the main compartment in order to get to it. And that's about it, you know. I'm not gonna, you know, everything else about this bag for me is just fine. I, I, I don't, I can't fault it differently. Uh, the only thing, as I said, for me personally is, you know, when you go, f you want to go for your cash quickly or your phone is ringing, you want to pick it up and, you know, everybody now, we all have these bigger smartphones which you, you can't really carry in your pocket, um, you know, so you put it in the bag, so it's ringing, you need to pull it out and so on. So that's not the most convenient thing. But other than that, you know, it's, it's just really great. So I'm going to reach out now here 
to get my laptop what I'm currently using is uh, a MacBook, a standard MacBook Air 11 I like the MacBook Air, Air 11 because of the portability and you know I, I just you know because I need to take my computer every day with me to work and back and work and back and I like the computer to, to be small and light so I usually put it to protect it, protect it in a case I have this case here from a company called Book um, it's your you know standard zip case with uh, soft felty material inside so I put usually the the computer inside of that and then I would throw it into the bag. Why I want to show you this is to demonstrate that although this bag is the smallest one from the collection uh, um, it's by far not really, you know, it's not really small so keep in mind that that's an 11 inch laptop plus if they put it into this case it actually more of resembles more of a 13 inch MacBook and even though I put it in there is still around this amount of room on the side of the bag so I believe that this bag actually could house a 15 inch laptop without a problem so you know although it's compact and smaller it will take a lot so uh, putting a laptop in there it still as hopefully you can see something here it still allows to put more stuff here so you can put the brick here for uh, you know for charging the laptop and you can put you know other you know if you have a pouch with cables or something like that's gonna fit inside there another nice thing about this bag is usually you know with the smaller bags there's not a lot of organization inside the bag and I, I don't like that I you know I'm a person that likes to have you know likes to put stuff um, where you know in a certain place so I know that for example my phone is on the right side of the bag my you know wallet is here so when I grab when I want to grab it when I open it I know where it is um, so I do appreciate this bag from that perspective as you can see or you cannot see um, on one side you have one two three four pockets in this small bag plus two pen holders and then you have another big one on this side so that's quite a lot for a bag of this size and it's definitely that tells me that it was on somebody who was you know designing the bag inside thought about okay so this you know it would be good for this bag if it's going to be used to you know as a work bag to have a decent organization nevertheless that it's small so inside as I said this is what you get inside from the organization side um, nothing else inside than the, your standard Louis Vuitton uh, logo here, this particular bag was made in France I hope that you can see that and that's about it okay um, let me let me see, okay let me try to just quickly dig down here and pick up the straps, so the straps are very, very easily attached, you know you just they are, you know, they have a spring mechanism here and you, this is how you put them on on one side put it on one side and I'll do the same on the other okay and this is, I, I did this because I want to show you one more thing is you know nevertheless you know that the bag is not your bigger, the biggest bag uh, the strap is sufficiently long for anybody I mean it doesn't matter you know if you're six foot or taller you will still able to put your bag you know cross the shoulder or on the side and adjust it to fall to pretty much whatever you want and that for me and uh, I, I, I know from a lot of other people is also a very nice thing to have because some of the bags are sometimes riding just too high with this particular bag and this strap you can really adjust it you know the way you want to adjust it for yourself alright guys so this is my uh, this is my Louis Vuitton Porte Document Jour bag in Damier Graffite. I hope you have you know, enjoyed this video. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment box below. And if you like the video, uh, hit the thumbs up, uh, like it and subscribe to my videos. I hope I will do some very soon. And I hope I talk to you in the next video. Thank you and bye for now.